everybody and welcome back to another episode of Cherish on a Budget. Today I don't really have a budget tip but I've been getting this question for quite some time. But before I tell you what the question is, please subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to click on the notifications button and let's get started. So if you follow me on Instagram, <laughs> I kind of get asked a lot how do I maintain looking youthful or young? And for those who don't know, your girl is 35. I was born in 1983 and I am 35 years old. So in this video, I'm gonna give you guys five tips to stay looking youthful. If you are in your teens and 20s, you can do these tips to remain looking youthful throughout your 30s and just put you on the path of youthfulness. I don't know what that was, but well, let's go. Uh, tip number one, drink a lot of water. Anybody who knows me knows that I basically only drink water. I don't do sodas. I drink juices sometimes, but not a lot. And the other beverage that I drink is wine. Your girl loves her wine, but not too much. On a day-to-day -day base, I drink water 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 i try to drink at least a liter of water but anything more than that is even better tip number two try to maintain a healthy ish lifestyle with that i mean don't smoke um i cannot stress this enough please don't smoke smoking really ages you and if you can please don't smoke if you already started smoking quit now because it will age you faster than you should um other than that try to eat as much healthy food as possible get your vegetables in there um, me personally i stopped eating meat two years ago so i don't really know if that is helping me stay and look younger but just try to reduce like red meat and if you do eat meat eat more or less chicken and, uh, and stuff like that Tip number three, exercise. I mean, I've been training and exercising ever since I was a little girl. I started doing ballet when I was four, and then I became a gymnast for, I think like 10 years. Yeah, 10 years, I would train every day, three to four hours. In my late teens to mid twenties, I didn't really do a lot. Just your basic going to the gym, blah, 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 workout and but i always kept in motion i always kept busy i always kept exercising mm, now almost two years ago yeah two years ago i started doing pull class for workout and as a hobby and it keeps not only i think my face looking young but also my body really fit so it helps that the face and the body is you know still looking young tip number four sunscreen Yes, black people use sunscreen. Black people who say, I don't need to use sunscreen, start using it. It is really important to use sunscreen. I like to travel to hot places because in the Netherlands, when it's hot, it's cool, but you know, whatever, the sun doesn't really do what it's supposed to do to my skin when I'm in a foreign country. So when I go on holiday and I don't come back, at least a gazillion shades darker, your girl's upset. I'm like, I want my money back. I didn't fly to the overseas and the middle seas to come back the same ashy color that I left. No, 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 no. But I always use sunscreen. Even if it's like a very low factor, I always use sunscreen to protect my skin from the harmful UV rays. When I'm not on holiday, I also use sunscreen for my face. All my products that I use on my face, foundation, daily moisturizer, they all contain sunscreen. Tip number five. Sorry. <laughs> Tip number five. Always, always, always clean your face. I clean my face twice in a day. I wash it in the morning and I wash it at night. Um, I like to wear makeup, as you can see, and you have to remove your makeup before going to bed. So I just remove my makeup, wash my face thoroughly, and then put a uh, scar-reducing scar cream on my face before I go to bed. I really, really have to stress that 
um, taking care of your face and doing a routine every night and every morning does really help to keep the like the well not you like the youthfulness but like the moisture in your skin because the drier your skin gets the easier you get wrinkles and you start looking old so you really need to keep on hydrating and moisturizing your face as much as possible me personally i have a very oily skin so that's also adding to the youthful appearance uh, but i just keep on moisturizing my face at night washing doing facial mask or once a week or once every two weeks just whenever i feel like doing a facial mask just when like oh my face needs a little pick me up then i'll just do it so yeah those are the five tips i got for you guys to say staying youthful uh for a very very long time i do have one honorable mention and that is genetics um they say a black don't crack and well apparently this black ain't cracking when i look at my mom my mom passed away when i was 17 so i have her face until 49 so it's 14 years from now will be 49 and she didn't really have like a lot of wrinkles here but she had like frown wrinkles um, i remember that from her um, but when i look at my aunties I mean, these women are in their 60s and 70s and their faces are snatched. I mean, snatched, like no wrinkles. Being like, I thought her aunt is like 73 and people are just like, what, you're like 50? I was just like, what? She looks so incredibly young, it's insane. So genetics also plays a very, very, very big role in staying youthful so these were my tips thank you guys for watching if you got any more questions please put them in the comment section below and that's that see you guys next time don't forget to subscribe click on that notifications button because you don't want to miss anything i have to say and i'll see you guys next time bye